Hey guys, this is Gus69 from Metal Open Mind Brazil. This is my very last video for 2021. I wasn't planning to do more videos this year because I'm leaving tomorrow. Uh, I will stay away from, from my collection for about a month. I'm going with my parents to spend some holidays in the beach so I'll be back only next year but today I saw a contest entry by my good friend from Finland Mr. Fing Finglish from Bad English Rex and uh, it's for a very cool channel that I wasn't aware of called Art Room Records very fun family channel uh, the guy which is by the way a Metallica fan also uh, he does videos with his uh, son Kevin uh, with his wife and some videos and also with his beautiful daughter uh, which his name is Pond right uh, so I don't know his name I saw a couple videos three or four videos but I didn't catch his name I'm sorry about that but anyway a uh, very cool guy and very fun videos and I decided to do this is a contest like a push to 100 subscribers but he's already well uh, way above that so congratulations uh, for the, your first milestone uh, so this is a very simple a contest and the prize I think it's an, an Aerosmith record store day special edition I think it's uh, one of their first uh, demos or things like that from 71 pretty cool uh, prize and the deadline for this contest is December 70th so hope more people uh, go check him out art room records and make an entry to it's very easy uh, we only have to show color red vinyl and answer three questions so the first one ah by the way i did uh i think was two years ago i did a contest entry for digital gramophone i think uh, and I did a little twist showing my top five uh, colored vinyl from bands from Brazil. So I will do that again, but showing different albums. Some of them I already showed in different videos, but not all in the same video like I'm about to do right now. So I will show a couple extras, but I will answer the three questions, okay? So the first question is uh, my favorite album or favorite band uh, with a color red vinyl. So uh, I do show this one before. It's a band from my hometown, Sao Paulo. They are called Labirinto. Very cool post rock slash post metal instrumental band. Uh, very atmospheric, a lot of keyboard, but very heavy. Uh, I'm in love with this band. This is not my favorite album by them. I do have, but it's not color red. So I decided to show this, which was released in 2019. And it's called Divino Aflante Spiritu. Title in Latin, I think, but very cool artwork and the vinyl is transparent see-through can you see me and has this uh, uh, gray in the center very unique looking very good so labirinto my first pick second question a uh, favorite color so I have to go with red for uh, like plain color. I like red. 
I like also black, of course. I like white too. Uh, but red, for me, I think stands out. Uh, and red is always, um, uh, I don't know, it's uh, a color that gets you attention, um, gets you hungry sometimes, gets you passionate most of the times. But anyway, red is good. And I decided to show this album by Jack Devil. Uh, it's called Unholy Sacrifice speed trash metal band from brazil very cool um, i think i showed this one before and of course the vinyl is red custom labels very good bands and as a bonus I decided to show a 7 inch uh, by a all female uh, band called Girly Hell. Uh, this one title is Hit and Hunt, Run, has two songs Hit and Run, like the girls' school album. Very good band, hard and heavy, and of course. It's red. Custom labels again. Very cool little seven inch by Girly Hell. And this is for Pond, because I messed up with her name, I forgot. <laughs> and uh, I decided to show something uh, from my childhood. Uh, I remember listening this when I was a little kid and it's not music but it's uh, kids stories this album has three different stories uh, the story of the little cockroach cockroach um, the elder the kid and the ass and the I don't know how to translate this, but it's called Amora Torta. This uh, older woman here. Um, anyway, uh, probably the first time I saw a color red vinyl. But as I said, it's not music, it's someone telling stories very cool and this was released before I was born this is from 65 so very old um, this uh, was with uh, my aunt who unfortunately died seven months ago and I decided to keep because uh, it used to be on our uh, family um, or when I was a little kid and she was keeping I, I didn't know that but when I saw it I remember listening to this and I decided to keep to remember her so this is for Pond an extra so, last third and last question, uh, the prettiest colored record. So, beside the plain colors, I like very much uh, splatter on, uh, on vinyl with different colors. And I, I decided to show this album by Mads Nix. I think I showed this one before also. It's it's the debut album by this band called um, title is Incognita. Um, they play like uh, alternative rock, grunge style. Uh, they were uh, produced, uh, I think it was mastered by Jack and Dino, 
who used to work with Nirvana, Soundgarden and many others from the Seattle scene. So they play very much like Nirvana, but singing in Portuguese. And the vinyl is red with black splatter. I think it's very pretty. And again, red, my favorite color on vinyl. But not only red, as I said, Sometimes I like different color schemes. I'm a designer myself, so I decided to show another little bonus, another seven inch by a hardcore band from Sao Paulo. They called Bayside Kings. I think it's very hard to see and I will, I will explain why. The album is called Warship has six tracks in here and these are the guys Bayside Kings this is the vinyl blue uh, light blue with purple splatter very cool and you need this to see the ship popping up from the album artwork. So that's why you can barely see, but very cool idea, customized glasses that comes with these, uh, I think it's an AEP, six songs, very cool. Uh, another Brazilian band. So that's my entry. I hope you enjoyed this one. I showed total six records, but uh, one was just for Pond. <laughs> um, that's, as I said in the beginning, my last video uh, for 2021. I will be back next year, but I would like to thank you everybody who checked my videos, that commented, um, left comments and likes and uh, all my subscribers of course. Um, you motivated me to continue doing this. I have another channel in Portuguese where I'm more focused on that one. Uh, but I do like to interact with all of you here in the vinyl community and I will continue doing so. So, hope everybody has um, uh, an awesome holidays and uh, watch out because the pandemic is not over yet and be safe and I see you all next year.